Mario wants to win! Here you go! Thank you. Hey, Mom! Uh, Let me carry it! Oh, thank you! It might be a bit heavy for you, though. Don't worry about me. I'll be fine. Okay, here you go, then. Ooh, this isn't that bad. I'm okay. Well, would you take a look at that? All grown up. You know what? Take this. You've oh. earned it. Thank you. everything, so I didn't want to lose to him. So what happened? He just kept beating me in everything. So I stopped trying to compete with him. You don't have anything to worry about. Just keep doing what you always do. Are you sure? I'm also dealing with the same thing right now. But in my case... It's three against one. Toto, Rita, and Pippa? Mm-hmm. Well, just the other day, the four of us had an eating contest. Ready? Go! <laughs> but I came in last. <laughs> but they all laughed at me. But that's not healthy at all. You need to chew properly. Shimajiro, don't ever let Hannah beat you. You need to show her that you're the big brother. You're right. I don't know about that. Huh? Since you're the big brother, just let her win once. Hannah will be happy and she'll stop competing. Huh, that's also a pretty good idea. All right. No racing like you did yesterday, okay? Okay! Good. I'm glad to hear that. Donut! Yay! She's looking at me. I can't eat like this. There's nothing to worry about. Just keep doing what you always do. Yeah. Why should I race and ruin this donut? <laughs> that was yummy, Mom! Hannah finished! Huh? Huh? Uh, what? Wait! Did you drag me here to see which 
one of us can pile the blocks the highest? Mm hmm Come on, Hannah. Huh? Since you're the big brother, just let her win once. Hannah will be happy and she'll stop competing. All right, I guess I'll let her win. I'm not going to lose to you, Hannah. Ready? Go! <laughs> Here we go. Ah, look what I did! I guess you win then. Huh? What's the matter, Hannah? Don't you like winning? Huh? Bad! Does she know I let her win? Ready? Go! All right, let's go. Oh! Shimajiro! Don't ever let Hannah beat you. You need to show her that you're the big brother. If I show her she has no chance of beating me, she just might give up. Now, I don't want to see you competing with your brother, okay? Is there anything that she can't turn into a contest? Oh, I know! <laughs> hey, Hannah, do you want to draw pictures with me now? <laughs> what are you drawing? Shimaju! You're drawing me? Sure. Now watch me closely. Ready? What? Mom told you to stop and you're still competing with me? Oh, I give up. You win. Yay! Hannah win! Hannah did it! Yeah! Yay! <laughs> Our little Hannah, huh? I really wonder where she gets her competitive streak from. It has to be you, right? I'm not competitive. It must be you. It can't be me. It's definitely on your side. Huh? No, it's not. But... Oh! oh. Hannah's got that right, at least. It's not good to fight, right, Hannah? No fight! No fight! <laughs> you got us there, Hannah. <laughs> <laughs> Play at the Wonder House. That's too bad. Let's just go. Oh, hey, what's that sound? Ah, what's this wind? Sorry about that. Don't worry, children. What's that? Is that a new invention? Yes, and it's my best one yet! An airplane that can take off from the tops of trees and land on them! Wow! Is that it over there? Huh? Yes, I've named it the Hope! Wow! Once the engine and propeller are done, the Hope will finally be complete! Mr. Orson, what gave you the idea for the Hope? It's been a dream of mine since I was a little boy. From that far back? Yes. Now, where did I... Uh, right around when I was your age, I asked my mother if she could buy me this book. It tells the story of the mother tree, the biggest tree in the world. It looks like such a big tree. And where does the tree grow? It's on a tiny island that we know very little about that's called Mist Island. Mist Island? I've never even heard of it. It's surrounded by mists almost throughout the entire year. And the ocean currents around the island are so fast, it's impossible to approach the island by sea. 
Oh, I get it. You built the hope so you could fly to the island, is that right? That's correct. My childhood dream is almost going to come true. Wow, Mr. Rorson, that's really amazing. No, especially not after all the worries I must have caused my poor mother just to chase this dream. Mr. Rorson, can I get a ride on the Hope once it's finished? Me too, I want a ride. I'd like to take a look inside. Me too, since I've never been inside a plane before. Yes, certainly, but only if your parents give you permission to go on board. You can tell them the plane comes with tools that will help you safely escape the plane if it starts to fall. Then why do we need to get their permission? Well, Flappy, there is one thing that you should never, ever do in your life. It is to make your parents sad. Do you understand? Mm-hmm. Wow, the hope, huh? He just keeps inventing one thing right after another. I want to go on board once it's done. You don't have a problem with that, right? I would prefer if you didn't go, though. What? Why not? I'm just worried about all the bad things that could happen to you. But I really want to go on board. Your mother is worrying about these things for your own good, Shimajiro. Mr. Rorson did say I shouldn't do anything to make you too sad. Then why do you still want to go on the plane? Mr. Rorson has a mom too, right? Why would he let us on the plane if he knew it was going to make her sad? And he said that there'll be tools inside to help us escape if the plane starts to fall. I still think it's a bad idea, Shimajiro. All right. How about we do this then? I'll give Mr. Rorson a call and make sure everything will be safe. Hello, Rorson here. Ah, Mr. Shimano. I completely understand your concerns. But fear not, I will be bringing buzz packs with me, which are much safer than parachutes in case of an emergency. Actually, I'm using one now as we speak. <sighs> Sakura? It sounds like Mr. Rorson has a pretty good safety plan in place. Why don't we let Shimajiro go on board the Hope with him? All right then, but only because you think it's safe. Hooray! <laughs> really? So I'm the only one riding the Hope? My grandma said it was okay, but my mom... My dad started to cry because he was so worried about me. Yeah, even my dad was like... I trust Mr. Larson, but I'm not about to put my son on a plane when I don't know what's going to happen. Uh. I didn't expect that at all. My inventions do sometimes have a tendency to fail. I understand. Mr. Rorson, please take good care of my Shimajiro. I promise I'll be flying as carefully as possible to make sure Shimajiro is safe now. Bye -bye. Bye -bye. Prepare for departure. Isn't the view great from up here? Now, let's go even higher. Wow! We're flying even higher than a mountain! This is so awesome! I wish the others were around to see all this! That's a rain cloud. If it's all right with you, I'd like to test how the plane flies inside that cloud. What do you think? Uh... Good. I think you made the right choice, Shimajiro. Time to go home. Oh, 
I got so worried when I saw those rain clouds approaching. Thank you so much for returning so quickly, Mr. Rorson. Well, my mother wouldn't have wanted me to put Shimajiro in danger. Unlike you, my mother has always been a very, very strict person. So I'm glad I avoided getting her mad. <laughs> well, you must be really scared of your mother, Mr. Rorson. Now, come on, Flappy. But you're right about that. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't get to ride the Hope for all that long, but I sure hope I get to ride it one day to Mist Island and see the Mother Tree. Don't want Daddy. <laughs> I think Hannah's having fun. She always looks forward to bath time with your dad. You're as clean as a whistle, Hannah. Hannah, <laughs> clean! Now, how about some juice to cool off? <laughs> huh? Uh. Mr. Froggy! Let's go to bed, Hannah. Have you seen your father? No, he hasn't come out yet. Hey, Dad! Are you still in there? There. That should have washed off any odor. Shimajiro, give me a sniff and see if I smell or not. Okay. You smell nice, like soap. Great. Hmm? Hannah! I just took another long bath. I bet I don't smell anymore. See? Hannah doesn't like you anymore, but I think you're worrying too much. You heard what she said last night. Don't want daddy, right? <laughs> She's been saying that about a lot of things lately. Besides, Shimajiro used to do that too. What? Me too? Oh yes, your reply to anything I said to you was always no. They call it the terrible twos for that reason. You were quite a handful. I didn't know that. But it's nothing like that. Hannah really doesn't like me at all anymore for some reason. I'm sure of it, and I just can't. <laughs> what? Hannah? Mm-hmm. And my dad's very upset about it. What got into Hannah? Well, I don't have any idea. She was having fun during bath time, and then after that, it was just no. Don't want. Oh, that's normal. Huh? Girls change their minds all the time. One minute they're laughing at something funny you said, and the next they're frowning at you. Hmm. What did you say? <laughs> Nothing. <laughs> it's not like you never change your mind about things, Flappy. Right, just now. Uh, you're right. <laughs> So I guess it's normal? Yes, of course. I bet Hannah will be back to liking your dad in no time at all. Huh. I'm so sorry to hear that. I didn't know who else I could talk to about this. I know exactly how you feel. It makes me think, what if Mimi Lin suddenly told me that she didn't like me? I hate you, Dad! I feel like I'm going to lose my mind just thinking about it! Sota, I'm sure Mimi Lin will always love you. You don't know that! Wait, I know what I need to do. I need to be a cool dad! Yes, that's the ticket. Just you watch. I'm going to score the greatest goal today. Well, me too. Is that... Shibataro, pass it here! There! there. Duh. Dad! Uh... Oh, hey! Why are you playing soccer? Hey, everyone! We just happen to like playing soccer, right? Sure we do. I bet we could beat you in a match. What? Really? Then maybe we should play a match and find out who wins. That sounds fun! I'm in! I'm in! Uh, w well, uh, how about we practice a little more before we have a match? Oh! Shimajiro! 
Oh! <laughs> oh, Hannah! What do I do? It's your chance. Let's show Hannah what a cool, awesome dad you really are. Uh, but, uh... What? I promise this will work. It's been a while since you last played. Huh? Well... Shimataro! Go! Kick the ball as hard as you can. All right. Watch me, Hannah. Dad's gonna oh. shoot a goal, Hannah. Come on, Dad! Yo, boy. That's why you were playing soccer? <laughs> and now I really do smell from all that sweat. You should wash yourself with lots of soap so Hannah will start liking you again. I think I will. <laughs> Ready, Dad? Uh-huh. Hannah, do you want to play with Daddy? No! What? What am I doing wrong? Poor Dad. What's wrong, Hannah? It's fine. Sakura, I'm gonna go for a walk now. Mm. Thanks for your support, Shimajiro. Mm. Dad! <laughs> Why are you being like this? What? Now me too? No, no! What is it with you? Mm. Oh. <laughs> Shimajiro, where did you get that smell from? Huh? Huh? It smells a bit like mint. Ah! It's Dad's shampoo. I used the wrong shampoo today. So that's what it was. <laughs> No! Oh! So this is why! Dad! Huh? Shimajiro and Hannah. <laughs> I'm sorry for worrying you all, but I want to be alone for just a little longer. Shimataro, you've got it all wrong. Hmm? What? Hannah wasn't saying she didn't like you. She just didn't like the shampoo. Oh, okay. What? All of that worrying, and it was just the smell of my shampoo. I'm glad it wasn't about Hannah not liking you. Uh-huh. I'll have to start using a different shampoo. Shimajiro. Do I still smell like that other shampoo I was using? No, you're fine, Dad. Great! And the bear said... <gasps> you must be sleepy. Then, it's time to carry you up to your bed. Hannah, do you still think Daddy smells? I love you too, Hannah. Good night. <laughs>